Let's wait a minute. Yes. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We are the team. Oke. Okay. Keep smile. <laughs> uh, Nafila have the same uniform with me. Oke, okay, good. Uh, always keep smile even though your tea is so hard. Please. Oke. Okay. We'll send to you. <laughs> oh, that's very <laughs> so sweet ya. Yeah? Oke, okay, sweet. I like it. Oke, okay. because this one. Oke. Oke. Part 1, dialog, part 2, monolog, and part 3, discussion. Oke, okay. can you tell me your surname first? Nabila. Mm -hmm. And where do you live? Uh, I live in Depok Oke, okay. uh, okay. let's a little bit. Clearly ya, yes ya. Yeah. A little bit up and clear, like you hear me now. Oke. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Just relax. It's easy for you. This is easy for you. Amin. 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 I'm sure you can do this better. <laughs> Part one. This is about foreign language. ya. Yeah. How many languages can you speak? Why or why not? Okay, well, uh, I can use three languages. I was born and grew up in Indonesia. Um, mm -hmm. So you can say I speak Indonesia fluently. Mm -hmm. I know English as well because it is taught as a compulsory subject in my school, in my country. And the last language is Germany. I love study both with this. Uh, the country is Germany, so every day German is great for me. Hmm, great. Then how useful will English be able to you in your future? Why or why not? Well, I think knowing English increases my chances of getting a good job in a high profile company or of finding a school seat to study board. You know, uh, English is the most commonly spoken language in the world. So this language will give me a big advantage over others. Mm -hmm. And what do you remember about learning languages at school? Why or why not? Alright, uh, English was the one of foreign foreign language I learned at high school. At that time, uh, I was a big fan of the subject in any case. Anyway, attending English classes was a real nice dream for me because our 
teacher's idea of teaching was to stand the podium and then read from the textbook for the entire 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. And what do you think would be the hardest language for you to learn? Why? Well, I actually tried learning French a while back and yes, it is currently the most challenging language mm -hmm. I really ever know. Mm -hmm. uh, everything, uh, everything fell apart as soon as I started to learn by heart three different alphabets. After struggling, after struggling uh, in my friend's class for a few weeks, I realized that I was not cut off for this language. Okay. So, do you have uh, an idea how to learn a new language easier? No. Uh, I think to learn uh, a new language, uh, I can reading a uh, books textbook about the language for example a japanese book or a french book or german books mm -hmm. okay the last question for part one do you think it will be better if you learn a new word from translator application or learn a new word by reading from a dictionary Okay, I think I agree with a uh, dictionary, not a translate, because this uh this uh translate is not same with the my term like a uh, bad translate because uh in my uh in my opinion uh I like to translate to a, a dictionary. Mm -hmm. Good. And now part two, I will show you the view card. Okay. <laughs> I can uh, write, write the note in uh, Microsoft Word, right? Yes. But uh, later, one minute only to read this now in screen share. One minute only. Yeah, you will have to talk about the topic for one to two minutes. But before that, you have one minute to think about what you're going to say. So you can make some notes to help you if you wish here to describe a website that you bought something from. You should say where the website is, what you bought from this website, how satisfied you were with what you bought and explain what you liked or disliked about using this website. One minute to take a note of this topic. Time serious. Okay. One minute. Yeah.
Okay, I think I'm for you to explain that. Okay. Yeah. Start right now. Mm -hmm. Yes, please. Okay. Okay, today uh, I'm going to talk about DMD, which is a one of my go to website mm -hmm. when it comes to using products. Mm. Well, I first used this website about one year ago when I needed to buy some elegant product for my friends in Bali. Mm -hmm. yes, uh, what I like most about this website is the variety of products it can uh it can offer on the website. The mm -hmm. website owners who apparently have a great passion for Paris beauty product. Mm -hmm. It's like a diesel of black thing. Mm -hmm. Manage to get uh, the most beautiful and medicinal costly made product from quality materials and sell with uh so done with a uh, rather reasonable price mm. so shop so far shoppers can easily find their ideal brand within a few clicks in the in few clicks in a wide selection mm. of one of a kind beauty product mm. so a uh, ranking from blast on, blast on mm. to moisturizer, mm -hmm. and then I believe that anybody who like B and B product will mm -hmm. uh, definitely like this beautiful gift. Oh. And then, uh, uh, in my opinion, in my in my opinion, uh, this website is a great place to find a gift for your friends for your family. Uh, is an interesting interesting source of information about a beauty product. Besides uh, displaying the product, the owners of the website also upload many videos about uh, skin care routine, skin care routine, and how to get healthy skin. Okay, I think that's enough. The time. <laughs> okay. Wrong. <laughs> Next part three. Discussion. There are two topics to discuss. Okay. The first, still about shopping online. What kinds of things do people in your country often buy from online shops? Okay. Well, in my opinion, in my opinion, if there's an online business in Indonesia that is uh, never out of fashion. I suppose uh, it must be clothing, as clothing is an essential item in people's lives, and this of fashion mm -hmm. has never failed to hit uh, the market with it. So, selling uh, accessories are also really common on the internet, especially on Facebook, TikTok, and then Instagram. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. And why and why do you think online shopping has become so popular nowadays? Okay, well, uh, the most obvious reason is that it's first time we get a couple of click the most. So mm -hmm. first time purchase almost everything they need, they want. And then decide when shopping online, they can enjoy the freedom to figure out with which online store offers that the most affordable item. Mm -hmm. And what are some possible disadvantages of buying things from online shops? Uh, I think, of course. <laughs> Because a uh, online shop does not come without its disadvantages. And for many people, 
in my opinion, the most annoying thing is tipping cost. If they buy something product from the another country, first can uh, rise uh, significantly. And then also when uh, it comes to buying clothes or footwear, uh, mm -hmm. it is uh, difficult to estimate the size of the products properly. And then mm -hmm. so people uh, can end up making a bad purchase. Okay. Yes. The second topic, culture of consumerism. Why do many people today keep buying things which they do not need? Well, uh, let's say, uh, well, uh, in my opinion, uh, there are few psychological uh, reasons besides uh, the taste and the money they have. Uh, let's face it, uh, we, are, we are also it by marketing. Advertising not only make us remember, and just nice but brand, brand better. Mm. So uh, they also work through our emotion, emotion and uh, affecting our preference and then uh, changes our, uh, our uh, changes our attitude towards product. Mm. Okay. Do you believe? the benefit of a consumer society outweigh the disadvantages? Well, let me see. Um, well, uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, mm -hmm. uh, I cannot see any benefits from it, in my opinion. Yes. Uh, consumerism uh, encourage people to have more desire uh, manipulate uh, them into uh, wasteful purchase mm -hmm. and then more imp importantly uh, it leads off uh, overproduction mm -hmm. which is uh, the primary cause the, of the exhaustion of natural resources mm -hmm. as well as the ever increased amount of toxic waste okay the last question how possible is it to avoid the culture of consumerism? Well, in my opinion, uh, I think the solution uh, is all about uh, attitude and the perspective of life you have. Uh, well, uh, uh, also, it is not very easy. <laughs> To get rid of some of the mm -hmm. behavior we have adapted for a long time and then if we can't really think about our negative effect the culture of consumerism con consumerism mm -hmm. uh, may have may have on our life and the natural world changes can start slowly but slowly okay <laughs> it's not Vila. you look like a lecturer yeah? <laughs> I just hear a kind of lecture. Kayak perkuliahan ya. Overall, you have a good statement, but still, uh, nya banyak nggak kira-kira gapnya? Yes, <laughs> Padahal because, uh, idenya bagus. Sebenarnya idenya oke. Okay. Nah, itu ya. Be careful in IDP. Don't use a a. <laughs> a a nya diganti isian well. well. I think. Kok nggak ada well nya tadi pak? Tunggu-tunggu ya. Anyway, by the way, tapi bukan busway, ya, yeah? oke. Okay. Ah, anyway, by the way, busway. <laughs> Overall, good. Maybe up to six. But I hope uh, next in IDP, you get better. In IDP yeah. yang penting, ya, the most important. So, in this occasion, I hope that you can forgive me. Mohon maaf lahir batin, minal aizin, non saizin. Look. <laughs> Maaf jika banyak hilaf katanya. Semoga ya yeah, I hope we can meet again in another country. Oh, oh another area. In the next small. <laughs> oh no ya. <laughs> so you have uh, successful. Nabila and can contact me anyway if you're free of course. 
kulit. Uh, by the way, by the way, uh, my test, uh, my writing test, uh, can be letter on the in the evening, yeah. Yes, in the evening. Uh, yes, maybe uh, maybe uh, nine p.m. It's okay. It's okay. On the canvas, canvas. Yes. Be careful this one if the what is your internet connection must be stable yes, yeah okay. yes canvas uh, yes. stable internet connection okay thank you very much for your trust to me <laughs> as a loyalist loyalist fan fans <laughs> keep smile always and keep successful in the track thank you thank you by the way oh yeah by the way uh i was uh great uh writing test for part one so i will finish to part two yeah but uh i will i will submit uh the on the website mm -hmm. of the night oh yeah tell me your name ya miss name-nya kan ganti-ganti tuh changing Miss saya namenya oh. ini gitu kan. Kadang ada yang dibalik, misalnya Miss Nabila jadi Miss Sukma. Wah. Oh, Miss Laras. Oh. Siapa ya nah, kan ganti-ganti kan itu namenya. Oke, okay, no problem. Okay. I'm waiting for nanti text Miss live dan gitu ya. Thank you Miss Nabila. I hope to meet you next time. Take care of your health ya. Yeah. Don't stay in hospital. Stay in more. <laughs> Hang out. Thank you very much. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Keep practicing. Bye-bye.